Welcome back. Well, another day of off and on showers here across the Cadiana. So you'll get a period. You'll see some heavy downpours and then the sun kind of comes out and that actually helped to drive our temperatures into the upper 80s and lower 90s. Probably a pretty similar setup tomorrow. And then by Tuesday and Wednesday, it looks like we'll see more of a steady, perhaps widespread rain. So uh, we'll get into that in just a second. But here's a setup. We have this frontal boundary that's uh, pretty much stalled out off to our north and we're south of that boundary. So that's keeping us in a moist kind of unstable uh, environment here across the Cadiana leading to better than normal rain chances. Now, as we dial it in to power Doppler three again, uh, relatively quiet, uh, at least through the heart of Acadiana, but we are tracking some downpours out there, especially as we get into portions of Iberia Parish, say in and around the Lydia area. This particular cell continuing to push off to the north and east and back to the west again, some light to moderate showers as uh, we get into Acadia Parish in and around the Iota area or points just off uh, to the north and west. Another little uh, downpour here approaching Crowley probably in the next 10 to 20 minutes. So again, we've got to maintain at least some rain chances through this evening, but uh, otherwise should be a relatively quiet night ahead. We'll see those overnight lows dropping down into the mid 70s. So that's where we'll start the day tomorrow. And again, very similar setup to what we saw out there today. We'll see passing tropical downpours throughout the day, primetime mid morning through the afternoon hours. So yes, rain chances at 60 to 70%, but uh, it's not going to be raining all day long. And in fact, when we do see intervals of sunshine, that will help to push our temperatures into the upper 80s and lower 90s. Now by Tuesday, going to be tracking the surface low feature off to our north as it slowly tries to push eastward. That's likely where the heaviest rainfall will look to set up, but still here in Acadiana, we're going to see a good scattering of showers, few storms just about at any point on Tuesday. Rain chances very healthy at 80 to 90%. Notice the surface low very slowly tracking eastward. So that's going to keep us unsettled into Wednesday as well with another healthy chance at scattered showers. Now as we uh, take a look at the uh, available moisture here per the GFS model again, we're drenched in the red, so very moist atmosphere in Acadiana at least through the middle parts of the week. Maybe by the end of the week, some drier air trying to slide in to help lower rain chances just a little bit, but not really a guarantee at this point. Meanwhile, rest of the tropics as we open it up into the tropics, relatively quiet one wave just off the African coast, uh, but that is not likely to develop in the next five days. I'm a little bit more interested in a way that's currently uh, centered over Central Africa at the moment. I think once it gets into the Atlantic, it should have a little bit better chance to develop. So that'll be something to watch by the end of the month. Heading into the first week of September, GFS kind of hinting at that here, but uh, still way too early to tell where it would end up, even if it were to develop. But again, that's just something we'll kind of keep an eye on here uh, over the next several days. Meanwhile, our rainfall totals over the next week or so pretty good soaking uh, here across the Cadiana. Most of us uh, will say two to four to five inches of rainfall. But again, I think slightly higher amounts are going to be setting up more so across the northern parts of the state. And as long as those totals fall within a week's worth of time, we should be OK regarding some flooding. But so we'll keep an eye on it. 76 for the projected low tonight. Few showers out there this evening, but those those will come to an end uh, by sunset and then uh, as we kick off the new week tomorrow again, very similar weather pattern to today passing tropical downpours uh, rain chances at around 60 to 70% and then again more widespread kind of steadier rain as we head into the middle parts of the week. So washout certainly will be possible Tuesday going into Wednesday and elevated rain chances sticking with us into Thursday, hopefully lowering the rain chances a bit by Friday, but we're just going to have to wait and see on that. Very good. Thank you, Bradley.